On April 5th, two Belco volunteer firefighters were severely burned when their fire truck rolled over. Thanks for joining us tonight. Jason Smith and Tyler Morris were fighting a wildfire in Beaver County when it happened. Tonight, KAMR Local 4's Kaylee Green hears from the wife of one of those firefighters about their conditions. That story, topping our news tonight at 10. While Jason Smith fights wildfires, his wife Amy tracks his location using an app since they can't stay in touch. But she knew something was wrong on Tuesday, April 5th. I noticed that he was driving really fast. I looked at the, the app and it said um, he was going 111 miles an hour. Highway Patrol had him in his car and was rushing him to the emergency room. Amy was able to track Jason down but did not know the extent of his injuries. I thought I was going to the emergency room to try to tell him goodbye. So just very thankful that he's alive, honestly. Both Jason Smith and Tyler Morris were burned during the incident and flown to the burn unit in Lubbock, where they went through several procedures. The good news, Morris has been released from the hospital and Jason continues to recover. We know that we can get through this and um, we're just grateful that he's alive and try to keep our mind on the fact that we're not planning a funeral, you know? Mm -hmm. It could have been a lot worse. Plus, Jason was supposed to have another surgery Monday, but the doctors said his arms are healing well. Still have some work to do, but they feel pretty good about the stage that he's at right now and want to send us home sometime soon. He's extremely tired, and um, but he's doing good. He's, he's still pretty uncomfortable, but we're making a little bit of progress every day. Amy says volunteer firefighting is a weekly commitment in the spring, especially with high winds and dry weather conditions. I think everyone is um, very grateful that we have volunteers that help with things like this, and this accident just kind of brings some of that to light. And the Smiths say the community has rallied behind both families, even starting a GoFundMe to help with costs. They say volunteer firefighting is a community effort and farmers and oil field businesses regularly put their own equipment and lives in danger to help their neighbors. Live in studio, Kaylee Green, KMR Local 4 News. Jackie. Kaylee, thank you. Reinforcing that notion of it being a community effort, Jason Smith says, quote, firefighters are the flashy side of it, but I've been saved by a farmer with a disc more than once. Reporter David Gay has much more on this story. Find that at myhighplains.com.